In this video lesson, I will show you what is a pip calculator. You can go to Get No Trading website and you can find a pip calculator under the Forex calculators. The tool has several fields that you need to enter to calculate the pip value of a certain currency symbol. First of all, here it is on the right side is MT4 trading platform that you will use in your trading or you can use any other platform. But for this purpose of this example, I have used Euro USD currency pair with a balance of $100,000 with a USD a deposit currency. So on the left side, I have a Forex pip calculator to calculate the pip value. So in the first field, you enter the number of pips. Then you have instrument where you can select any currency symbol or instrument you would like to have in the calculation. Then you select a lot, which means if you enter one, that means one standard lot or it is 100 units of base currency. Then you select a deposit currency. A deposit currency is the currency you have here in the trading platform under the balance. And that means if you invest any money on your trading platform, you will need to select which currency will that be. In this case, it is a USD, but you can change that to Euro, British Pound or any other currency available that your broker allows you. Then you have here the Euro USD one pip size. And that means if the price changes on the market by 0 0.0001, that means one pip. In my case, this broker, which I am currently using, and that is a free MetaQuotes trading server, it gives me a price of the Euro USD with five decimal points, which means 1.0796 and the last number. But you can see that after the decimal point, I have five digits, which means the final one, which is the currency currently here, one, six, one, is a pipette. So we can leave the last one because our Forex calculator, it consists of only four digits after the decimal point. So it is 0001. In our case, it is 0794. If we go to the trading platform and see the current market price. But have in mind that this MetaQuotes trading platform is using the current market price, which is 1.0793 and so on, it's changed. But this Forex calculator, it has its own the price. So the difference between these two prices on the Forex PIP calculator and the trading platform will be slightly different, but the difference will be so small, there will be no too much difference in the price PIP value. So let's continue to see how to use this PIP calculator. For example, if you open a trade on the trading platform, for example, I will open a new trade. I will leave the volume, which is a lot size, and the lot size is the number of lots, which is currently here one. I will, for example, sell the trading pair. And it's done. So let's see what do we have here. In the trading platform, you have here the price, which is the open price. This is the price we have opened a sell order. And then we have a current market price, which is 1.07938. And the difference between these two price prices is nine pips, oh, sorry, 0 0.9 pips, which you can see. So if you make a pip difference calculation between 1.07929 and 1.07938, it is a difference of 0.9. So this is almost a one pip, but here in the profit column where you have, you can change that to have it in your deposit currency or in the points. I will put this as a points, so it will be much easier to follow because here we have a profit in a USD and sorry, in the pips currently. And below that we have in the US currency. So we have both information at the same time. It will be much easier to follow. So the price difference currently is one pip because it is a 10 units, which means 10 pipettes. But have in mind that the pip calculator is using the number of pips, not pipettes. So in this case, 
the price difference between the open price and the current market price is 1.3, 1.4 pips. So when you go here in the pip calculator, when you enter the number of pips, which is the difference, for example, if we leave it as a one and leave it the instrument Euro USD, lots is one with the deposit currency USD, you click the calculate and you get that one pip will be equal to ten dollars. So if we if you wait here until the price changes by ten, which will mean one pip, the profit or the loss will be ten dollars. So for example, if we put here 0 0.8 and make the calculation, you can see it gives you eight dollars. So if you have here 8, which, mean, which will mean 8 pipettes, pipettes or 0 0.8 dollars, uh, 0 0.8 uh, pips, it will mean eight dollars. So for example, we have currently 27 and when we put here 2.7 and click calculate, we get 27 dollars. It is the same as we have here in the trading platform. For example, you can see here, sorry, 3.0. Which, mean, which means three pips, you will get here the value of $30. You can see it, it is the same like this. So to calculate the pip value, you need to enter the number of pips here and click the calculate. But have in mind that these values, the instrument and also the lots and the deposit currency must be correct. So have in mind that whenever you have, for example, deposit currency as a USD, and then you have a USD as a quote currency, and that means the second currency, the currency pair, the one pip value will always be equal to $10. It is, this is the calculation that you can calculate immediately without a calculator in your head. So have in mind, this is the only condition. So the next, for example, let's open another trade. Let's close this one but let's change the symbol so i will change the symbol so it is not the same as uh, the deposit currency it will be usd still but oh, sorry let's take another example and open a new trading account okay open account new demo account okay and let's put euro as a deposit currency okay so you'll see where is the difference okay great now we have euro as a deposit currency and we have a euro usd as a currency pair let's open a sell order again with the same lot size so it will be easier to follow this example so when you put here in the pip calculator, you reuse the instrument as it is, the lot size is one because we have opened one and deposit currency, it will be euro. Just type euro, select one and it will show you what is the current euro USD price. When you click calculate, you can see that the current pip value on the market is 9.20 euros. So it, it is not $10 or 10 euros because the deposit currency euro is not the same as the quote currency in the currency symbol. So, for example, let's see, after we wait for the one pip profit or we click here 0 0.5 and calculate, we get 4.6. So for example, let's try put it one, it is 9.20. So if we wait here until this profit goes to one, which will mean one pip, it should be close to 9.20 or the same. Let's see, it is eight pips, 0 0.8 pips, 0 0.9 pips, it is 0 0.8, let's follow it if it is possible, 0 0.5. not so easy to follow it two pips 18.40 let's see 
will it return to 20? But the goal is to show you that the pip value, you can use a pip calculator to calculate what will be the profit in the number of pips after you open or an order, sell or buy order. So for example, if, if you open here a sell order and you go here down, for example, you would like to see how much profit you will make if you earn, for example, two pips, you can calculate that in the euros and which will mean that you can make 18.40 euros. So this is the pip calculator that you can use every time on your trading platform, but you go here to the website get no trading. This way you can use any instrument and you can also change the deposit currency. So in this case, let's for example, it is 3.3, .3, calculate 30.36. 30 30.57. So you can see it is a small difference because the market price has changed and this pip calculator is using the current market price. So this is changing all the time, but have in mind also the price is different from one broker to the another broker. So the pip value will be similar. So you can use a pip calculator for any broker. In this case, I have shown you how to use pip calculator when you have deposit currency as a USD and also Euro for the Euro USD currency symbol. But what happens if you have, for example, uh, Euro as a deposit currency, but you use, for example, USD Japanese Yen? This will mean that the Euro as a deposit currency is completely different. It's not inside the uh, currency pair where you have US dollar and Japanese yen. So let's close this trade. Okay. Close this one. And for example, let's open new order with the same lot size on the USD Japanese yen. Sell. Okay. Now let's go to the pip calculator and change the currency pair to USD Japanese yen leave the lot size as a one and deposit currency is the euro. So when you click calculate, you get that, sorry, let's put this one to the one so it is easier. So when you have USD Japanese yen with a euro and you open a trade and if you make one pip, that will mean that you will earn 6.93 euros. So you can wait until this one changes to one pip it is seven, nine, eight, nine. It's already two pips. Let's see if it will return to one. Here it was already. You can see 6.25, similar to that, 6.95. Yeah, 6.95 and my pip calculator says 6.93. Now you can see how the pip calculator calculates the pip value so for this currency symbol so you can change any currency symbol and make also changes to other here settings for example if you use another lot let's change the lot size so you can see how the lot size influence of the pip value let's open a new order let's put 0 0.1 which is uh, one mini lot and then let's change this one also here to 0 0.1 calculate it is 10, 10 times less than with the standard lot so if you go here and you see it is 10 0. Point, 0. 0.69 0. 0.69 is the pip value in my case is 0. 0.693 i have uh, one more digits here to calculate much more precisely if I want. So you can see how to use the pip calculator in different values when you change from the pip, the number of pips, okay, to the instrument, to the lots, deposit currency. So there is one thing that you need to have in mind regarding the uh, pip calculator and that is that you can change, instead of using the lots, you can use switch to units. And that means you can see it here, there is a note that Forex pairs are 100,000 units per one lot. So units per one lot vary on non-Forex pairs. So in this case, if you change this one, just click here, switch to units, and then it will automatically change the lot size into the units. 
So before it was 0.1 standard lot, which means 10,000 units. But for example, you can change that by yourself by entering, for example, 100,000, which means one standard lot and you click calculate, you get 6.93, which means the same as putting a lot size as a one. So if you change this one to the thousand, which will mean it is a one micro lot, then you calculate it is 100,000 100, times less than one standard lot. So you can use this calculator to calculate any pip value for any currency symbol that is available inside here, pip calculator under the instrument. For example, you can also use another symbol which is Dow Jones index US 30 and you click here as a USD if you use deposit currency as a USD and click calculate now you can see let's change this one to units to one this is okay and then click calculate you get that one pip is equal to 0.01 so use this pip calculator to calculate how much pips you will make in your deposit currency is it euro usd or any other currency that you have on your trading platform have in mind that there are several fields that you need to enter and you need to pay attention to after you're using them i hope this video helps you understand what the pip calculator is how to use it on your trading platform and how to use this pip calculator to calculate the profit of your pips after you place your trading order sell or buy on your trading platform and that means if you would like to uh, calculate how much you will make money if you use a sell order from this price point and for example if you go outside of your trade here after 50 50 pips for example that will be here after you go out of your trade with 50 pips of profit or it is your target or stop loss you can use this pip calculator to calculate for example just a minute USD Japanese yen how much money you will make or if you are putting this as stop loss how much money you will accept as a loss for example in this case you would use 376.58 US dollars or in the euros if you use euro as a deposit currency you will use 346.41 as a stop loss on your trading platform so use this in your advantage to put your trading strategy with the proper risk and reward by placing the correct stop loss and take profit basing on this calculator for the pip value I hope this was helpful I wish you happy trading and see you next time on the next trading lesson.